Man, that was quick. That's what's always fun about trying out a new spot. You, you just don't know what's going to... It's the first time and they're actually biting pretty good. Well, hey guys, we're back and we're going after them bluegills. These old buffalo gnats are out here and they're biting, so I'm sure the fish are biting. <laughs> we're going to be using some night crawlers today, guys. Let's go see if we can catch some bluegills. There it goes. Hey, this one feels pretty good. Oh yeah. He's uh let's see how long he is, just for the heck of it. He's a little over seven. That's a pretty bluegill, got a greenish tint to him. Alright, later. Yep, there he is. Oh, he's a, he's a good fighter, isn't he? Oh yeah, he's actually a pretty good one. That's a pretty one. Oh, belly's fat. These things are spawning. Yep, we'll take that one. And get my cooler open. Oh, he was there. Is there another one there? They might hit it again. Hey, kind of aggressive in here. Try right there. Wow. <laughs> I mean, there might be little guys, but they sure are. <laughs> they're biting fun. Man, that was some. That's some aggressive fish right there. Wow. Look at it again. All right, and he got on my bait that time. So, they know what they're doing. Let me get this on out of here. I'm just going to hook this just like this. I'm just going to see if he can get, get him hooked a little easier. Yep, he took it, but he didn't get it all. Trying to... There he is, finally got him. <laughs> oh, he's not too bad. I'm trying to get them old bluegills, at least seven and a halfers. He is a seven, he's right at seven and a half. We'll go ahead and keep a few of them. Well guys, today we're using the Alba Garcia Max X10 light spinning reel. I got it spoiled with six pound test high viz mr crappie fishing line and we're using the shakespeare micro series light action rod that's a five foot six they got seven footers too but this is my favorite one for brim and crappie i used to use the seven footer for brim by getting under the limbs and stuff this one works better so i kind of just swapped to this one and i think i'm going to stick to it there he is we got his attention in. What we got here? Oh, we got a crappie. Yeah, that old crappie jumped on it. Yeah, I, I ought to throw a couple copper jigs. Let's see how long he is, because we, we want him to at least be tenor. He's a nine and a half. He's a pretty crappie. That's a black crappie. Later. <laughs> There he is. Another good fighter, but he I ain't caught no big ones out of here yet, but we're catching some we are catching some. <laughs> some good strong little fighters. And they're pretty. Later. See if we can catch another one. He's on there. <laughs> Man, I tell you what guys, these things, they are hammering it. <laughs> They are, they are flat out biting today. I just can't get no big ones. But yeah, they're, they're pretty aggressive. I like to see the big boys aggressive. That's the thing. 
These little ones aggressive is one thing, but you start catching them slab daddies, then it's fun. Oh yeah, I seen something move over there. Let's see if we can get his attention. He's about in that area. He ain't gonna move at it, is he? Oh yeah, he is. He's on. <laughs> it just took him a second. Another little man. They, they got some bright, pretty yellows and some green to them. Ouch. Okay. Later. That's what's always fun about trying out a new spot. You, you just don't know what's gonna. It's the first time, and they're actually biting pretty good. Let's see how long he is. Ouch! He's seven and a half. Man, I want you to look at that colors. Look at them colors. The greens. They're pretty. Later. I'll check it anyhow. <laughs> oh crap he will hit this jig hook that's what's good about using these jig hooks guys they will hit a crappie will hit these jig hooks even with that night crawler on there but yeah we're just using a slip bobber a little eagle claw slip bobber some rubber bobber stoppers them are large size a 1 8 ounce jig head hook that's a size number 4 hook on there and then some piece of worm or night crawler and uh they're doing pretty good they're biting good i'd like to see some bigger fish in here but yeah they're biting really good that's a that's a they're good strong fighters but there's i ain't finding the size i'm wanting yet but that don't mean nothing because you want to go after them dudes around that full moon and i liked one thing about the full moon i like to go just two or three four days before the full moon because that's when i do really good all the way up there he is again until you pass the full moon hey he's a fighter oh yeah that's a pretty one they got some pretty colors green and yellows i got the blue gills but they got green up here and yellow on their bottom Later. We got a lot of good looking stuff coming up, so we, we're gonna keep on chunking at them. There he is. Oh, yeah. He's a fighter. Man, these things fight good. <laughs> now, he's almost, he's getting a little bigger. Let's see what we got on this one. Seven and a half. Pretty good bluegill. Oh, easy, 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 guy. <laughs> All right, later. Oh, there he was. Man, that was fast. <laughs> oh, man, I'm not fishing. I'm probably about eight or nine inches in the water. And they're, they're just, man, they can take it as fast. Look at that, just as fast as I cast it. Now, he's actually a good fighter. Yeah. He's still kind of kind of a little one though but they are some pretty bluegills in here i just hope i find some big ones later man he had it again yeah i've never bluegill fished this i just keep looking at it and i keep saying that looks like a good spot so he's on man they're so 
they're biting like crazy right there but it's got to be little ones because i'm not getting a good hook set on them I gotta i'm gonna try something right here. that ought to catch me. i ought to be able to hook him with that There he is. I got him. Whatever it is. He's a little guy. I think he's a little one. Good. Another good fighter. He's a fat looking one. Got a little belly on him. They do have some pretty... I got some pink. Pink and greens in there. Orange and yellows. Pretty fish. Yeah, I just wanted to mainly show you guys that this little lure setup right here, it's a good one. If you like casting with the rod and reel, this thing works everywhere. And you see all the little ones we're catching in here right now. It shows that you don't have to have that little bitty number six hook and number eight hook. I'm catching small brim and I got a number four hook and a jig head on top of it. So it just shows you that, you know, this is a this is a proven technique right here. There he is. We got another little one. Alrighty. Later. Oh, he's there. I got something in my drag. <laughs> Little guy was pulling my drag. Hey, that one's a... That one's a, like the little purplish color ones. Yeah, he's a light purple. Pretty one. And he's long looking. Later. another one <laughs> oh man this is this is fun only thing to make this any more funner is if they got a lot bigger <laughs> but yeah i can't gripe it's a new spot and when you can come in here and catch them on your first try it gives you hope that there's some pretty ones in here later gonna give him another try that they seem to like that spot right there look at this there's just another one <laughs> they like that spot right there oh wow he's pretty got spots like yellow spots yeah another pretty one later winds blow me around sideways but we still gonna try that spot pretty aggressive little fishes over there there's another one yeah i'm gonna just turn this boat the wind wants to change so i'll just turn my boat around <laughs> give them another try because they're still biting over there oh i mean look at that fast maybe i'll catch a big one over there eventually i'm hoping that might be close enough to keep no he's not <laughs> he's just a little dude pretty greens and yellows later there he is <laughs> fun fun 
even the little guys are fun when you catch a bunch of them later there he is we got him see if we can get him in here yeah we got him in here pretty lady There he is. Yeah, he's getting a little bigger. Later. I started out catching mediums and then they went to smalls. And now they're trying to get up there a little bit bigger. But I am catching them. Yeah, he's pretty. He's a he got a bluish green tint to him. Later. There he is. Another pretty one. Look at that orange. Yeah. Later. There he is. Hey, I hope he's big enough to keep. <laughs> I don't know about that. Nah, he's, he's a little short dude. I should have been keeping him seven and a half. But maybe we'll find a few more. That's a pretty bluegill. Later. He's already on it when it hit the water. <laughs> Man, if these things good ones, I'd I'd have to go home. I already have too much fish to clean. <laughs> They're fun though, later. There he is. Oh, we know what's going on now. There's a knot. In my line i'm gonna be changing my line later i got a knot in it and it's messing things up but another pretty one We got a little more, a little bit more power than that last one I just had. And now they're getting a little bit, a little bit broader. Shoulders on. They're pretty. I love the colors on these bluegills. They are beautiful. Like. You got him. Good little fighter. Yeah. Alrighty. Later. He made it. You got him to bite that time. Pretty little gills. Later. Got 
at him. Hey, he feels like a good one. He's a better one. Still, that's just a seven incher. It's a pretty gill though. Later. Wow. He's a good fighter. That's one of them. Man, look at that belly on him. He's been eating it a little bit or something. <laughs> yep. Later. Got another one. He's a he's a little little fighter. A little guy, but they got big heart. Later. Another goggle eye war mouth. He's pretty. Hey, this is a little different than the last ones. Different colors on them. He got some white tip deals, but he's got them stripes all over him. He's a pretty one. Later. He might not come back to this spot real soon. I'm thinking about checking out another spot and see what happens over there first. And uh, maybe we'll get into some dandies. I'm sure hoping so. Oh, he's going to be there. Or at least he jumped at it. Yeah, he was there. He jumped at it. <laughs> he's trying to be a big guy. He's fighting good. <laughs> All righty. Later. There we go. Nice. Pretty one. Pretty orange belly on there. Now there are some pretty ones in here. Let's hope we find the big ones in here one day. Later. Oh. It was on there. Oh yeah. Chunky brim. All right. Later. 